There we go. Hello. Hi. Our mic uh, decided not to connect for the first time for some reason. But uh, we're back. Okay. After last week, we were uh, kind of. What we had like. Oh, I just passed out one day. That's what happened. I yeah, I looked straight. over and she was just sleeping at her desk, and I was like, well. There's that. I was sleeping at my desk and then I woke up and I was like, oh cool, hold on, let me get up because we could still salvage the stream and then I just proceeded to lay on the floor and fell back to sleep. Hmm. And then, what happened Thursday? What was that Thursday? I Thursday. Yeah, because I had said, um, spending all this day in the dungeons and persona about to do play Persona 5. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So then you just played Persona 3 the whole time. I had to sleep. Oh, Monday I had I had inventory, so I was just worn out, and then we had a huge trek the next day, so I was just mentally exhausted. The fun of doing this was a full-time job. Yeah. Woohoo. Hmm. Um, but we're finally back with Ultra Despair Girl. Um, I remembered that at the end of next month, uh, Rain Code comes out, and it would be cool to try and play that. Um, as well as we've also got Paranormal Sight lined up, so a lot of things that we want to play, and we keep missing days. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, hopefully we'll, we'll start getting our, our crap together. One day. Um, it's hard when... My work has just been so busy. It's supposed to slow down hmm. after Christmas and not really pick up again. But uh, our store is so huge that we just do so much. Uh, but I, uh, my goal today is because um, my gums are a bit sore from getting the crown. Mm. My goal today is just to kind of at least complete this chapter. That way, all we have left is chapter or the final chapter. Epilogue, I guess. Um, which, yeah, yeah. which might take like maybe two streams. Um, but. Oh, um, as I came back to this, I remembered I had no break for this. I got a lot of burn now, so that's there's that at least. to get caught by the thing, so we're gonna, we're gonna do our best. Hopefully we won't have to keep going back a lot. Where's the growth oh, button? That's the sensor. I tell you to be careful. All right, sir. I'll kill you. Probably will end up doing so, but oh, there was a wall there. I'm an idiot. Mm -hmm. I well, I didn't realize. Oh. That Uh, if I 
stand on the button first. Yeah, I'm wondering if the monocrine is gonna come through. I see. Get a that door over there opens when someone steps on the switch. All right, four eyes, step on the switch. Then Kamaru and I can go through. Excuse or how me? about you step on the damn switch? That would leave me behind. <laughs> damn, here they come. We gotta run for now. Hey! What? Scared pants? I know. We can use a Monokuma to press the switch. Thank you. <laughs> Making some kind of machine? Looks like it. The moment I saw that business proposal, time just stopped. I understood immediately. In the end, I was just a frog in a well. But even so, just thinking about being involved in this kind of work makes me shudder with excitement. I want to pour my life into this job. If this gets out to the public, the life of every human on the planet will be more well off tirelessly to make this work. I'm sure some will complain bringing up safety concerns with the fact that the inner body is extraordinarily resilient, but it won't be a problem. I don't lend an ear to boring naysayers. Okay. How are you, Catch? Save again after. Close the shine. No, it looks uh, down there. It was declared earlier, early this month that the largest household electric appliance manufacturing company, Kanto, has been acquired by Toa Group. This brings the number of subsidiaries owned by the Toa Group up by eight, eight, up to 8,000. Toa Group and, by extension, Toa City has been receiving a lot of attention as of late. It's far too suspicious. 8,000, jeez. How big a scale are they thinking? You guys better not be planning world domination. <laughs> huh, world domination sounds swell. If we could completely control all the brats in the world and the adults, that'd be nice. <sighs> so it's just as I thought. That's not it. I'm just kidding. Toa Group isn't some evil corporation straight out of a movie. Mm -hmm. It's a financial group with a simple policy and reasonable assets, normal to a T. Aside from all the greed driving me to make this company the largest in the world, of course. Don't mess with me! No joke with me, and no good corporation like yours is no match for Togami Corporation. What? Mm -hmm. Are you from the Togami family? <laughs> 
Well, not yet, but I'm planning to become one. Hmm. You're kidding me, right? What the hell is this chick talking about? <laughs> That's a long story. Just let it go. Not Let's really. See. Well, anyway, there's no dangerous ulterior motives behind Toa Group currently. I don't... Hold on. Currently? So it used to have dangerous ambitions? Well, we may be nobles now, but that doesn't mean we didn't start at the bottom like everyone else. I'm sure Toa Group was rather ambitious when they were still a startup. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about when your father was chairman before all this happened. Who knows, I wasn't exactly deeply involved with the business side of Toa, I have no idea. But it is true that Toa was working to put the incident in the past. Amazing! That's why they made all the air, air purifiers, right? Let's see. We also detoxify seawater and replant forests. We're honestly pretty good people. It's far too Those suspicious. People, the moment you start using Monokuma's as guards, you stop being good. <laughs> Jeez, you're a pushy one, aren't you? I already told you, you gotta trust me on this one. I sure don't. And we should trust you just because you say so? Toko? Toko, I know how you feel, but now's not the time for this. Hmm. <laughs> I know. But... But Komaru, you can't trust this guy. The moment you let down your guard down, he'll touch your butt. Hey. On my honor, I promise I'm not into her, specifically. What I'm trying to say is, the younger they are, the better it is for me. <laughs> Stop being. That's a hardcore Lolita complex, the real deal. No, that's a hardcore <laughs> pedophile complex. But that's... <laughs> that's exactly what the... But I mean, the fact that he admits it, it's kind of a... No! Oh, this is the worst! You are really terrible at picking men. Man, Byakuya looks like a saint compared to this guy. Byakuya messed with a crime scene just because. Just for funsies. Just cause he could. He knew who the killer was and everything. Alright, so that was how we came. Oh, that's right. So this goes. This goes. This goes. So I'm safe here, maybe. Well, we'll find out. Okay. Let me take a gander. There was coin machines on the front of this thing. And I'm wondering if it's worth it if I'll get like break. doing it on purpose, are you? Because that would seriously piss me off. You know, that's fair, Toko. I feel like I had sparkles were around here. Hmm. Maybe I'll get over there and see what I can see. Do you see what I see? This is actually a good move because there's a sparkle over there. It works out. I like how they don't affect something. You know what? That's probably for the best. Oh, yes. Kirihito Tang. Kuhito Kirigiri. 
Hunting around to a bookstore. A wrinkly old demon who's been around like forever. It's got this organ that makes its head and the back of its ears super stick stinky. So be careful when you get close. There's also a rumor in that it's one of the founders of that detective library with all the books and stuff. You should read Danganronpa Kirigiri to know more. Okay. Actually, I think the sparkles is at the end. Hey, what the? Us. Break the siren monokuma up there! I feel like I'm being cheated. Catch, did you see that? Did you see a cheat? Did you see how that should be? Didn't I tell you to be careful? Shut up. No one asks for your input, sir. Nobody likes you. I don't even know your family. <laughs> you do now. My latte. <laughs> <laughs> it's that arcade machine. Oh, oh no. Let's get a move on. No! Oh, thank God. It was a bird. Yeah. But now I don't have any burn. Nothing's going to happen unless you open the door with a switch. Okay, wait. Hmm. What chapter is this? Four. Still chapter four. Okay. So. behind a wall and the alarm still went off. Um, I guess the corners are kind of weird. I mean, so to kill them, I have to hit that guy. So I wonder if I move him onto the button then link him, no, no, I, I link him, move him onto the button, and then dance him, and then get behind that guy and push? Oh, I can't dance him. Facing away, I guess. We can make sure he's facing away. I don't know what move would be used for here. What do you mean? Wait, they give me the move bullet, but probably not. Uh, oh, it, basically, so yeah, you move that guy on the button and then you sneak up behind the rolling one hit knock back to knock him all out.
Okay. Is there just more over there? They can stay over there. So. Alright, so that's the next area I gotta go. Alright, let's use the elevator to go down. I don't want to. What's wrong? Don't you think this is strange? It's just like I thought. This place is fishy. I agree. Monokuma's guarding the place. What they're making at this factory? Hey, what's the deal? The adults are all waiting for us back at base. Let's hurry up and get the trump card. I can finally show them hope. You don't have an apple here. You're not hope. Toko. What do you think? I have the Aho Gear. We've come this far. There's no choice but to go for it. I'll be the judge of this hope. Even Toko has one. Aho Gay. Oh, good. There's a laser here, too. Cool. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> you know. It would be dumb if they stopped the laser. Why do they seem like they're faster too? Oh, well, maybe. So. Oh, there's a room right over there. And of course, I do like a zigzag. Uh, well, I think I should hit that room down there first because it doesn't go anywhere. Oh wait, I can't. There's a gate. Yeah, I know. I said it does a zigzag. Wait. Huh? The gate is not on the map. Yes, it is. No, it is. It's... You're on it right now. I'm right here. No, you're up there where your person is. Oh, I'm an idiot. Silly me. I thought I was coming from there. Okay, never mind. It, you guys can't see me pointing, but I'm... Um, I'm looking at the complete other side. All right, you're right. I'm done. Okay. That's why I'm so confused. You know what? That's fair. Nothing over there. The shiny's on the other side. seen these parts coming out from somewhere before. Is it just me? Nailed it. Like an ninja in the night. Whoa. Hold on. I saw a laser go through that yeah. wall. me unfashionable. You only look good in white sock. Your virtue is still white, honey. Right. Alright. Whoa! The angling of these was ridiculous. to keep running the way that I'm going mm -hmm. to, so I can hide at the...
So that door is the only way. I'm gonna get behind that thing and look and see if I see any There's an arcade machine over there. Okay. I hope these are less finicky than the last one. Let's try using a normal Monokuma. Alright. Hold on. Okay, so I've got to get shit. Okay. I see. Dan or move that. He goes there. Mm -hmm. Link him. Move him all the way to that puddle of water. Stand on the button and shoot him with the shock. Yep. I was adjusting! Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. You are approved for the pool. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. He had, was like falling in the middle and like, I'm not answering this right now. <laughs> oh, I wonder if food comes Yeah, I guess I'm going to I'm going to go check and also tell them that we should be expecting food or whatever. Okay, I'll just stare at the next puzzle. Okay. It's that arcade machine again. Let's get a oh. move on. It looks complicated, but if you do it just right, you can wipe out all of them at once. Huh? Is patrolling, so I probably have to go by him to go over here and probably grab that guy and put him there. Or 
shoot that with a move. And then put that guy on the button. But if I shoot that guy with move, the guy moves off the button. Right? And I can't knock back that guy because he's in... He's in a... Not round form, right? I'm on the right track. Because, uh, like, I need the gate to open because I... Well... Can I move that guy and have him go all the way down and be on the button? Because he doesn't get distracted by the move guy, will he? But that guy's kind of in my way. Because I don't see, I, I don't think I can knock him back in and roll all those things up. Small one for the button. But I... Okay, so some, I, I link the small one for the button. Do I activate that thing at all? Because I feel like that would screw it up, right? And then do I just... N then I knock that guy into the bombs? I like that she left on the one I can't figure out. Maybe use Link for the bomb guy instead? Have the bomb guy go around? Thanks, buddy. Oh my god. Sorry. Link both of them? Can I, can I just link all of them and then shoot? <laughs> Is that feasible? Link all of them, have them all group up and then hit the bomb guy so he explodes? Is that a way to do this? <laughs> Buddy's back, so she can look it up. Okay. Okay. that bomb guy. Move him to the button. I worry activating I won't be able to get a good shot on that to activate it. Okay, so this is Shoot the normal monkey right next to the gate with the link and move him to the switch. Mm -hmm. Then activate the child device. Make sure the normal monokuma you just placed on the switch looks away from that device. Wait, hold on. So move him to the button. Mm -hmm. Make sure he's not looking at the thing. Oh, turn him away? Yeah. Hmm. Then use the button. And then after the bottom bomber monokuma has arrived at his position near. The device is knocked back bullet on the ball monokuma to push him to the others and kill him. Can I... <laughs> this is the way I need to go. Is he... He doesn't aggro me if I run by? It says... God, what the fuck just happened? What? I tried running past the thing and the camera just totally fucked. Oh.
that. I thought he couldn't roll. What do you mean? If uh, he was in that form. No, if you catch him off guard, you will. Oh. Like if you're, he knows you're there and he's fighting you, he won't roll unless he's got his limbs in. Let me take a bite of my chicken. Woohoo! Ooh, Ray. You can't you really have my to... onion ring, Indy. So, I'm gonna get behind that wall. I guess I could just kind of run over to that thing. Because either way, it's the same distance, I think. What the? Do you see that? Let's take the Catch! <laughs> oh, bull! I don't. Investigation of Genocide Jack. With the mastery of killing, they can even be called artistic. Genocide Jack changed the world. The rumors about him that flutter about are innumerous. Online, they talk about him as if he were a mere urban legend. However, he does really exist. In this book, we address the rumors, study the motives, and create the killer's profile. Genocide Jack is alive. I like how they put, like, Toko on the cover, though. Yeah. Amazing! She's a serial killer, what? I didn't know you were so famous. They made a book about you. I'm surprised. What's going on? Does it really matter? <laughs> well, thinking of you as a celebrity makes me want to act more formal. Nothing. Being famous for something like this doesn't make me happy at all. I wish I never had the other me. Hmm? But why did Genocide Jack get into you in the first place? Huh? Get into me? What are you talking about? Um... I mean, identity disorders are like that, right? Was there a reason for it? Like, maybe your soul switched when you got hit by a truck or something? Oh my god. There's no way something that ridiculously sci-fi would ever happen in real life. Hmm. It's true that she's inside me, but she didn't come in from the outside. She's more like a personality I created out of suppressed emotions. <laughs> that sounds kind of sci-fi to me. But if that's the case, what was the reason you, you suppressed your emotions? My mother. It's my mother's fault that she was born inside of me. I never thought of them as my real mothers, not even once. Hmm? Wait, them? As your mothers? Don't you mean your no. mother and father? Gosh, <sighs> Maru. I'm a mo novelist. I wouldn't misspeak like that. I said them and I meant it. I have two mothers. Um, oh, did your dad oh remember? Oh my gosh, <laughs> Maru. No. No, he wasn't married to begin with. Sounds complicated. At the hospital where I was born, a baby born at the same time as me died from a medical accident. That's not so uncommon. However, hmm. through some mix-up, the hospital wasn't able to determine which mother's baby had died. And that's why I have two mothers, you get it now? Oh, but no, that was something completely different. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, wouldn't they be able to find out which child was which with the blood test? Right. Both mothers declined the exam. That's fair. A loving mother wouldn't want to face the possibility that the baby who died was theirs. Both of them wanted their child to die. What? 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 Hmm. They also discovered that both women had slept with the same man. Oh, okay. Of course, that would be my father. <laughs> I mean, who could have thought an ugly and pure woman like me would have a player for a father? Don't mess with me! That was a prime opportunity. You were supposed to object to the ugly and impure part. You're making that face is just making me feel way worse. Sorry. Sorry, I just can't even imagine. Anyways. Anyway, because of all that, my daily life is full of stress. 
For a while, it turned my negative feelings into novels, but it got harder and harder. To release the feelings that I couldn't bear with my novels, Genocide Jack was born. Um, wow, that's a pretty amazing story. Wow. Well, I'm sure my extraordinary birth helps a lot with the writing extraordinary novels. But thinking back on it all now, I don't think it was that big of a deal. Um, Toko? Oh, don't you dare get weirded out by my story and try to change the subject now. You're the one who asked, so you're gonna wallow in these bad memories with me, damn it. No. No, it's not like that. How should I say it? I like you, Toko. <coughs> huh? What the hell are you talking about? Oh, sorry, that came out a little wrong. What? I like you as a friend, Toko. So what do you want to say? Forget it. I was I was going to keep going on about my misfortunes, but I seem to have forgotten. Aww. What dysfunctional friends. Hmm. Ah, no. Literally. Right? <laughs> For that one sliver of battery I accidentally <laughs> used. <laughs> Dysfunctional as Buddy asking me to smell her armpit. Hey! <laughs> Why would you bring that up? Mmm. <laughs> oh, there's a room over there. Is this still lasering a laser about? Huh. That's yeah, suspicious. That's just sibling bank. <laughs> Smelling on it. Okay, so there's a shiny. <laughs> The following series will be developed into five types, including the prototype. Currently planning on investigating each into general office work, good, good work, bodyguard work, rescue work, and cleaning work. As the series becomes more popular and recognizable, we will expand into other horizons. Okay. So it's funny when I went downstairs to tell Dad about hmm. the approval. He's like, did you buy any Pokemon clothes? So I was like, no, you told us not to. He's like, there's a Snorlax one. I'm like, what? <laughs> like, how do you know? <laughs> hmm. Oh. What should we do? We can't move the elevator like what this. What should I do? <laughs> Don't worry. If you input the password in the management room, the lasers will shut off. The management room is at the back of the conveyor. We should go there first. No, nah, sure. I want to walk through the lasers. Just a bit more. If we can get to that elevator, we can get to the deepest area. Once we're there, the trump card is ours. Jeez, this sucks. I'm starting to wish I just left. Me too. <laughs> like us, not you. Yeah. Togo. I wish we found Biakia. It's just like I thought. I have seen these things before. Why is something like this being made at a Toa facility? What? Not a boom? Like, I thought, I thought we... I thought we already discussed that. Yeah, I thought this was... No we... skill. No yeah. skill. Mm. I don't know where the sparkles were the last time. Oh man, it's on floor four. No, it's on this floor. Oh, is it? Yeah, the you gotta turn off the lasers. Also. Okay. 
in here a room a body you know what? i should have saw that one that's <laughs> been discovered just like i thought what what you expected this explain this guy wasn't killed by a kid he was killed by a guard monokuma that went haywire but this is a problem he's the only one who knows the you password think? to turn off the lasers what are we gonna do? How we do gotta you find know? That password somehow. I'm sure there's a clue or something in here. We can't just give up. But that's my middle name. Give up? Yes. You know what I think the password is? 11037. If it's 11037, I'll lose my shit. I'm gonna turn off the game. Hey! Oh, come on, don't start complaining. Look at that computer. Let's just do this. <laughs> if we input the laptop's password, the lasers should turn off. Please let us Check try. This place from top to bottom. Then we'll find it for sure. Can we please be allowed to take a shot in the dark? Boobs. <laughs> Boobs. Huh. Okay, well, I don't see any secrets. Calm down. Oh, I was hoping it was Leon. Why is the music just keep funny? I don't know. Okay, I guess I have to examine this first. Digits. Hey. 1037. Hmm. Oh, sorry. I <laughs> what the password here to turn off the lasers is like a round way, he said. And there's no way we could possibly know what it is. <laughs> we gotta look for a hint. There's no other way. After getting a good look around, let me know. Maybe I can think of something. What's going on? I don't really expect a punk like you to come up with a bright idea, but thanks anyway. <laughs> okay. This seems important. Happy birthday. 69. <laughs> and, uh, 8? Something's written on the bloody photograph. Happy birthday, 69-8. So, 6-9 so cool. something 8. With the blood on it, it doesn't feel like a happy birthday picture at all. So who wouldn't do that to a birthday yeah. picture? It says the password is my son's birthday. What's going on? Your son? Well, actually writing down a password like this, how technologically impaired are you? Should I use this to log in to some shady mail order website? <gasps> Toko, why do you know about shady mail order websites? Don't mess with me! Shut up, that's not important right now. <laughs> anyway, we get the password if we can figure out his son's birthday, right? Hmm, maybe the picture with the birthday. But all right. Do you know his son's birthday? Is he one of the? Are you me, the right? son? Are you sure you checked everything? Oh, we didn't check the body. So cruel. This is far too cruel. This is the worst. The fact that I'm starting to get used to this kind of thing disgusts me. Huh? Huh? What's this? The third Saturday is my son's birthday this year. And I can't wait to spend time together. I can't see my son and my wife's... Does that mean 28? 69... Wait, 6... No. The passage is written in the blood stain notebook. 
third Saturday is my son's birthday today. His wife smiles in my mind. What should I buy um, for a present? I wonder if he was able to spend time with his son on his birthday. Anyways, no time for tears now. So it said it said six hmm. nine zero eight. So I just don't know what. I don't know where the six nine. I mean, I assume one of them is the month. I'm assuming it's 28 since it's a third Saturday. Yeah. Okay. We search through everything that looks interesting, right? You're right. We should be able to guess the son's birthday from all the information we've got. Um. Hmm. His birthday is the set. The third Saturday with the number 69 and 8 on the photo. I saw enough info at all. You're kidding me, right? Hey, don't give up now. <laughs> I can't think of anything yet, but talk to me later. Well, you're sure. I might think of something. Cool. You're so good. Am I allowed to just put in. 69. I think I just have to talk to him later. No? Okay. Maybe it's like supposed to be 2006? And then it's uh... Hmm. August 9th? Or August 28th. I'm sorry, September. <laughs> <laughs> I would not have gotten that. Is it because we have to look at it weird? Yeah, that 69 is not a 69. Okay. Um, I, I was thinking it looked kind of weird. I don't. I don't know if I would have never gotten it because I don't know these. Is that Aquarius? No, it's Pisces? Cancer. Cancer. Uh, See, I would never would have gotten that because I don't know those signs. I thought that would, it. If I saw something like that. I would have thought it would be Pisces, and that's wrong. And that's funny because I'm Pisces, so I would have been wrong. <laughs> mm, Aquarius is the waves, I think. I only know Taurus. Yeah, Aquarius is the two wave. Well, kind of zigzag, so it's like not really. Okay, so Cancer is bad. Did you say bad? Mm hmm. Alright. June to July. Third Saturday. So it'll probably be June. So six. I don't know what that eight is for. How is it not June? So he's like right on the cusp of whatever's after cancer. So seven. What's the eight for? Is it just at the end? That's supposed to be an eight. So all right, no, the answer because I was confused. Of so it has to be four numbers. So. And it has to be zero seven because it's July. Yeah. 
and it has to be the third Saturday, so what number would be before the 8th? Maybe 28. No. 18. There you go. Okay. So 0718. Oh, oh, 0718. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm an idiot. <laughs> that was one I was like, I'm not going to be able to figure this out. Okay. Um. 0718. Oh, I forgot that, like. Like, that's a cool puzzle like that's really cool but uh, unless you know like the signs yeah i think it would have been cool if they showed us like the or or like you could pick up a book that had like yeah. the astrology on it um oh no i just realized it's in the star yeah well that's what i was trying to i was looking at the 69 i was like could that be something else? I don't know anything shaped like that. And I guess they had to use something that looked like a number. Yeah. Well, also, like... That was 11037 all over again. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think it would have been okay if they did, like, a more recognizable astrology yes. sign, because you would now still have to, to figure out enough. I knew I could trust you guys. Yeah, I can't trust you, though. Yep. Knew you were an idiot. You sure talk big. You couldn't even look us in the eye a while ago. But. Harper pooping. Yeah, but coming from the people who wanted to explain every single thing in V3. And thinking that 11037 was a really, really hard puzzle. And then they throw this out here. <laughs> Although Buddy actually found somebody who, uh, who didn't oh. figure it out. Look at my top right corner. Oh! Hey, look. There's an astrology link. <laughs> if we had seen that, we probably would have. But I, I think if they had it down further. Yeah. Because it's a little hard to read unless I get like right up on it. Because it just kind of looks like a bowl, bowl, uh, like a clock, kind of a dartboard. Yeah. Oh, okay. with me, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have known the months. Oh, yeah. Well, hmm. we could have at least looked that up. Yeah. I guess I could have figured... Because I think Aquarius... I would have figured out gen uh, around where the month was because it's Aquarius, which is before you, then Pisces, which is you, then Aries, and then me, and then Gemini, I think, and then Cancer. Not again! <laughs> oh. Right, I've been I've been too playing too much Hogwarts. I keep trying to do the thing where you see everything. Uh, Rebellio. <laughs> Rebellio. That's like I don't know why what game I was thinking. But when I ever I'm playing Persona 3 and I'm like in a dungeon and I'm like trying to pull up the map, I always hit the triangle button, which is the menu button. I'm like why do I keep hitting triangle? I don't even know what game <laughs> has a. I knew I could count on you too. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, so now you like us. There's gotta be an enemy in here, right? There's a triangle. So. So the sparkles are definitely in this room. Oh. Oh, hey. Slow Pokemaru. <laughs> Pokemaru Naegi, a typical mass-produced demon that isn't unique in any way other than that it's below average in a lot of stuff. It's a perfect demon to try new items on. I would never. Wait, wait, where is it? Oh, up there. I see it. I see it. Just a bit more. A bit more. The hope's almost in our hands. You clap. 
a giant massive monokuma in there, bro. Monica. Okay, wait, was that everything? I don't think there was anything over here. Oh, there was, but you had already gotten it. Oh, okay. I couldn't remember how far the lasers went. Alright. Last time? You saved, right? I think I did, but I'll save after getting that sparkle. Just to be safe. I cure. I yes, it's free. Cause it's free. I assume we're fighting a blue haired kid soon. But I don't think he's down here, because that would be crazy. So but this game crazy. is not normal, so like anything could happen. I got moved from a building to a moving train and Toko somehow managed to get me. So like anything can happen. You just believe anything is possible. You just believe. Oh, I have enough bullets. Even if you did, you still wouldn't. <laughs> it wouldn't matter. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, hmm. you know. How are we supposed to know? Oh no. It's scrap now. I know I would stop thinking about it, but it crosses my mind when I least expect it. Are we the warriors of hope truly in the right? I tell myself that we are in the right just every time, but sometimes I fail to convince myself. Do I really want this? When was the last time I truly felt guilt or remorse? Obviously, we were treated horribly, the worst of the worst, but even so, I feel that I am in debt to my parents for raising me. I hate it, but I can't stop feeling that. No matter how they treated me, I still owe them affection and respect. Jesus, run on sentences, Nagisa. It's Just a heavy like feeling five. in my- <laughs> Well, apparently, all that freaking studying went to nothing. <laughs> Okay, no, so I love you. What is he, Thomas Mon? Okay. <laughs> it's a heavy feeling in my chest. Something I can never tell Masaru, Masaru, Jotaro, Kotoko, or even Monik. I need to stop thinking about things like this. I, we, have a revolution to think about now. A paradise to build. For us and for all the children of this town. I need to save Monica. It's her I need to think about. She is much more precious to me than my own life. Aww. Gross, but um, and here are you good? Okay. I was just welcome pushed into that soup packet. <laughs> I mean, more quality I time. Think, I think I. Whee! Whee! <laughs> Tree into Monokuma. For the first time, Monokuma in 3D. Oh god. No! Okay. Battery. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Nice. Good get. Okay. <laughs> Good show. Meh. Here we are. Our trump card is just behind this door. The game just decided it was gonna have me do that now. <laughs> Our last hope. You've got to back far, there. But this is just too suspicious. You the think? Up? Kamaru, open the door. But be careful. Why would she open the door? So, I'm the one who has to open the door. Yeah, make him open the door. Yeah. Let him get killed. Nope, I guess you open the door. Alright, I'll be the man. And I'll wear the pants even though I'm wearing a skirt. Consider all the dead children. Oh, okay. 
Who I'm didn't not see that one coming? You okay there, buddy? Like, I knew it was going to be a Monokuma. I just want to know how nobody is questioning how we're going to use a giant Monokuma against Monokuma to make things better. It doesn't make any sense, especially since he just said, Hey, our Monokumas went rogue and killed this guy. Like, I feel like his plan is to just destroy the whole island they're on. Oh, yeah, probably. Probably. And kill them all. Yeah. Our trump card. The last hope for us adults. This Monokuma is the last hope? No. It's not just an oversized Monokuma. It's I'm a secret sick. weapon that was built by Toa Group in case we ever needed to defend the city. Or From yourself? Yourself? it. If we use Big Bang Monokuma now, uh -huh. we can uh -huh. put up a fight and take back the city. It's just as I thought. This is wrong. Why did Toa Group make such a thing? And not only that, this whole factory! You were building Monokumas here? What's the meaning of this? Why are they being built in Toa's factory? Ugh, don't tell me. You better not turn out to be the mastermind or some bullshit like that. Hey, come on. If I were behind it all, why would I make Monokuma break my arm? If you really didn't break broken. your arm. Then you better start talking. Uh, show me your arm while you're at it. The Monokumas that are built here were supposed to be introduced to the world as made robots. Okay, then make them hot. <clears throat> they were developed to assist daily life and also to help with dangerous labor tasks. Like, they don't even have thumbs. Wait, no, they do have thumbs, but that's the only finger they have. But those kids ended up taking over. In what way would this giant thing be a maid exactly? Yeah, that's fair. Only this one's about special. That one specifically. Didn't I tell you? This was built to protect the town from danger. Guys, just push them over. Then why make it look like a Monokuma? If these things were supposed to be made robots? Make them hot. Don't blame me. I didn't pick the design. The one who developed them chose that on their own. Was it Junko? Yeah, I was about to say. Don't blame me is a classic excuse for dodging responsibility. Typical. It yeah, is what it is. It a lot. At the time these were being made, I wasn't even aware of it. Mm-hmm. Uh, wait! About the one who developed them. Rumble! Oh, what is it now? It's time to rumble. <laughs> oh, I ate most of the food. I still have my onion ring left. And a pizza. What the hell happened? Is that a sniper? Yeah, it's truly despicable. I'm on your side here. Let me guess. Did she tell you about this? If she can't control it, she wants you to destroy it? Oh. If she Monica? can't have it, nobody can. Well, I won't let it happen. This is the hope we finally got for ourselves. Is Monica to create it? You want to crush our paradise with something like this. I won't let you. Everyone expects so much of the Warriors of Hope, and of me. To meet these expectations, I have to build paradise all by myself! <laughs> yeah, I 
honestly, yeah. Actually, <laughs> create a giant super robot to be a maid, yeah. So expect more of me! <laughs> I'll work harder! I'll do it! Anything! Just please don't abandon me! Father! Mother! It's this Juco! Monica! More! 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 Expect more from me! What's wrong with him? He's batshit crazy! No, yeah, that's you. Those in class houses should not throw stones. How did he get like this? Um, Monica? I can do it. I can really do it. Because out of all of the warriors of hope, I'm the best at controlling these robots! Well, I think you're probably right about that, honestly. Which doesn't go well for you. Shit. This is bad. Like he yeah. told her to run. The big Monokuma is the last hope for everyone back at the Why base. Why are you listening to that we guy? We know that Monokuma's gonna be destroyed, right? Yeah. The last hope for the adults will be gone. Yo. Are you stupid? You, are you actually going to protect that thing? I'm with you, Togo. Do you realize what you're doing? It's too dangerous. It's but stupid. Then again, maybe we have to fight. Huh? Maybe a certain someone's speech actually influenced me a little. So unlike me. But it's going to be all right. Look how far we've come already. Yeah, you're right. Shot. Nice, uh, baby. Oh, I see a lot of dodging. If I hunt things. you down, Monica will acknowledge me. She'll listen to me. She has to. Monica and I will be creative. Now's your chance, Komaru. There's no way adults who have lived in happiness can understand children like us. I put in more effort than anyone. I should be given more expectations! More! No! Oh, shit. He shoots through. What are you doing? Stand up straight! Don't mess with me! You damn adult! Expect more of me! Stop it! Stop it! Don't kill my hope! My stock damn adult! Is burn better for this zombie? Don't mess with me! Demons must die! Demons must die! Demons must die! Burn! Stop it! Stop it! Don't kill my oh, hope! I don't know if that's because I use burn or... adult. Hey! Aren't you going to watch me? Where did you go? Let's see. Oh, he went behind the freaking thing. Hey! Aren't you going to watch me? Where did you go? Burn! Oh, you would, you piece of... So how is it? Amazing, right? A plus, right? So how is it? Amazing, right? A plus, right? Three! 
Don't look down on me. No, I think I just need to not be bad. <laughs> you damn adult. So how is it? Amazing, right? A plus, right? So how is it? Amazing, right? A plus, right? All right, now you said, my boy. I get it. You want, hey, you want a gold aren't star. you going to watch me? Where did you go? Monica! Oh, God. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, all right! Oh. I guess you could say, he wasn't expecting that. Fuck off. Sorry, that wasn't funny. No, you're not. Now's not the time! We gotta save him! Yes. Just leave him. No! no. Huh? If we save this crazy-ass kid, he'll just end up doing the same thing again. He probably got crushed anyway. We can't save him even if we wanted to. You don't know that. More importantly, take a look at this. That's a lie. <laughs> we finally got it. But he doesn't understand. <laughs> the hope. We finally got our hope. Yeah, the way you're saying it like that, you sound crazier than Nagito. And, um, that ain't a place you want to be at, boy. <laughs> oh. All right. Let's ride this right to the enemy's HQ. Ride? How? On the Monokuma? Oh, don't worry. You aren't driving this time. How do you get that out? <laughs> and crazy. You wouldn't be able to anyway. The only ones who can control this are me and my old man. The convenience. So I've got to move this myself. Now, let's begin the counterattack. Once the others see this, They'll be pumped for sure! Actually, I'm pretty sure they're traumatized by Monokuma, so... Yeah. Probably no. <laughs> I just think, oh god, they got a bigger one. <laughs> they're just... They, they all just off themselves. See him like, oh, there goes the last of our hope. Oh, Nagisa. <laughs> Fuck off, Monica. I'm sure Nagisa has been crushed by the hope of the adults by now. Oi. Just as Monica expected. <laughs> it's just like I thought. He met my expectations to the letter. Well, well, I should get started on the final preparation. Huh? Now Dead. come on over here. Let's open the gates of hell with Monica. You too, <laughs> mom and dad. Excuse me. The climax is gonna start soon. Your child will be born again as the successor to Junko and Oshina. Okay, she's sliding, my guy. What are you doing? Indy, this is scary, but you're cute. I'm gonna look at you for a second. You're so cute. 
I think this is the creepiest face I've ever seen in a Danganronpa Honestly? game. And that's counting V3's really creepy face that Buddy will really hate. Wait, is A the t Did we decide if A was the top or was it a yes. <laughs> I miss you, Bayakia. Indy, you've slid down. Indy, where are you going? I'm relieved. It appears you aren't hurt. You are mine, after all. I would lose my temper if you got yourself hurt without my permission. I did get hurt, actually. I'm missing, like, three hearts. Now listen. Yeah, I am the only one who can hurt you. You better not be hurt by anyone else. Tech, like, tomorrow, lost the heart. Oh, that's true. This is tough. Destroying urge. New skill. New skill. New skill. The way we live. And who Ray? I'm not happy. I'm never happy. I miss Nagisa. They call us children and they treat us like mice. Alright, so chapter five is the last chapter. Yeah. One, I don't know what the names are six chapters. And it always trips me out. <laughs> Oh yeah, we are. I control this big bang monokuma. Yeah, like those those little the... monokumas are like nothing. It looks like the monitor room in the first game. Mm. <laughs> Rawr, I want your donuts. <laughs> Good work, you two. <laughs> you guys are the saviors of this town. Greetings. I came to say my goodbyes. Ah, oh, going already? But this is where the fun starts. For real, though! The real deal starts now! It's like you finally get the girl of your dreams, so now you can start wearing her underwear whenever you want! <laughs> that example was pretty clever! Let's put that shit on a calendar! Even Nagito is exhausted. By the way, He's before I done. leave, there's something I should tell you. You suck. Run. <laughs> oh, what? Is this it? You're finally gonna come out of the closet! Maybe. <laughs> I've received word from the Monokuma kids That's on weird. watch. An intruder has entered Toa City. He didn't deny it. And they came alone. Man, I play the second game. <laughs> I still love the little comic where it's like it shows 
Na uh, Nagito's brain, and it just shows like a couple blocks. And one is hope, one is sanity, and um, one is I forget uh, like everything else. And then it's like, where do I put this Hajime block? And he just like takes out the sanity block. <laughs> Alone? I see. Was this someone from Future Foundation? I don't know, but I recommend caution. Hey, look at that! How dare you? Wow, the impact! Bitch! It looks like an action movie, Meow! <laughs> if this keeps up, all the children might end up getting killed! You're in quite a good mood, hmm? Despite the fact that your plan is about I'm to be ruined. I'm for sure her plan is going exactly as planned. Yeah, I think she's now the ultimate despair, so she just doesn't care who gets killed. Ruined? You talking about ruined? Honkai, in fact. Monica's plan is totally going smoothly. Totally! Smoothly? You call this smoothly? Sorry. I know you helped me out and everything. But this plan is a secret, even to you. By any chance, is this plan related to the successor of Junko and Oshima? No! Zip zip your mouth! Well, it does not matter what you're planning. In the end, hope shall win the day. So to prove your little point about hope or whatevs, you brought on the despair, huh? Well, that's just fucking stupid. It's like going to the desert to drink some tasty water. It's totally contradictory, right? No, you misunderstand. In order to get rid of all the despair, you first must let it flourish. Wait until the despair has grown to its largest size, and then burn it. All the way to the roots. And after that, only hope will remain. That is the world I seek. There is nothing contradictory in that. Well, not that it even matters. Three crazies <gasps> in one room. So you're gonna burn the crops and salt the earth, huh? <laughs> when Nagito is the sanest of the three crazies. <laughs> you really are amusing, Mr. Servant. Despite the fact that you know you've fallen into despair, you still fight for hope. Could it be from Big Sis Junko's influence? Or were you always like this? Who cares, Monica? Just let this jump exit stage left already! There's something way more fun and refreshing waiting for you! Wait, your stage left or his stage left? Yep, you know. that's right! I'm really looking forward to it! There's <laughs> no stage. Just how will the world look through the eyes of the successor? Monica, you're so into it! Your heart resonates! Hot enough to burn! Thank you, Kurokuma, for giving Monica such a splendid plan! Uh, yeah, stop it. Your little hills uh, up against my body! Not okay. Mm. Not okay. Uh, are you pushing those little buds, Monica? No. Thank you for the hard idea. work, Mr. Servant. I'm sure we will not see each other ever again. You're so open. <laughs> Mr. Haiji, we're all here, sir. Good. Thank you. Everyone, Everyone, hear me out! I think it took out a good number of kids and stuff. First off, gave hope. I gotta apologize to you guys. I really don't understand how, like... I know I'm trying to make sense of a Danganronpa game, and that's just not gonna happen, but there's no way, even in, like, this universe, that they would see a giant Monokuma and be like, oh, yep, that's it. that That's my ticket out of here. There's when my they've hope. been terrorized by Monokumas. I mean, I guess Shirokuma has given them a little hope in 
some Monokumas, but... Yeah! Welcome, Celestia Ludenberg. Ooh. Yeah, Monica sucks. I don't. Do I you don't understand. I kind of don't like any of these uh, people. Honestly, no, not <laughs> just, at all. Just get me Biakia and get me off this island. The Toko reason Biakia, I was let's go. That base wasn't because I was oh, waiting for an Shira opportunity. Oh yeah. That was just an excuse. Really? And and the. I was just girl. scared shitless by yeah. those kids. <laughs> Makes me a pretty bad leader. There's many things that make you a pretty fast leader. Someone snapped me out of it. Those two girls over there, neither kids nor adults. You're you want to call them teens, then they're teens. Hi. Why are they back Thanks there? to them, <laughs> I finally woken up. Because they they have... they helped me, but they're all the way back there. Because we can't share this stage. They have a skin, so like <laughs> they can't blend in with these purples and blues. No matter how they, scared they you are, be, like, standing back if you want a them. hopeful future, yeah, maybe. sometimes you gotta fight for one. I mean, to be fair, also, I Also, would... how do they get out of the Monokuma? <laughs> Is there like a little elevator out of his butt? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. These um, are the questions you have to ask. But honestly, I would probably be very far in the back too, so I could make an escape when this all goes through. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. So never again. Never are we gonna hide and cower and lose what we care about. Bang. Now it's time to stand up. With our hands, we are gonna take back this city. And the people with portraits like that are usually killers. We have the power now. With Big Bang Monokuma, we can do this! So listen up! Teach those deranged kids who really runs this town! Toa City! Dead. Our home! Our town! Our island. Raw! Riot! <laughs> no, don't, no! Don't bring that cool guy into this mess of a situation. This is sorry, sorry. Things are turning for the worse. Yeah, thanks. Isn't oh, it better if the adults really are boring. a little more calm? Why would you? Yeah, I mean, there's that, and why would you also have a robot that looks exactly like the things terrorizing the world? Also, why does it have an A on it? It's an adultery. <laughs> it's an asshole. Oh, it probably means adults. Oh. <laughs> I was almost there. <laughs> I too was almost there. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, adults have them, don't they? <laughs> so do kids, though. Probably, but we can't just tell this group to keep level heads. They turn on us. <laughs> he looks like a monarch. Monarch, monarch. Cooper. <laughs> Kuma Cooper. <laughs> Monokuma. Monokuma. Oh, hey. oh, yes. Yo, gotta I say. About you. Shiroro wants to talk to you guys. No, thank right you. Away. Oh, wait, no, wait, yeah. Yeah, well, how about you come with me and we're gonna we'll run. We'll have a conversation. Sure, come on the way over there. There's something we have to talk about, too. So you guys are worried, too, right? It'd be bad if the adults attacked the kids, riled up like this. You think so too? Aichi seems like he's holding a grudge. Not just against the Monokumas, but the children too. Oh, he doesn't look like he's holding a grudge against the Monokumas. If they end up fighting like this, both the kids and adults will end up killing each other. I mean, what is this, Romeo and Juliet? Killing? Why did it end up like this? I mean, I know. didn't you I'm want the adults still to fight them back too? in his mouth. Shirokuma is talented. How dare you? Sorry. So sorry. Well, just like you, I didn't know that Haiji had that kind of weapon. I mean, did anybody know? The reason I tried to motivate them was to give the them the power the to protect booth? themselves. <laughs> Shut up. Shit. Shirokuma isn't Shiro about protection. Shirokuma just is trying to best. destroy. If the adults and kids fight one another with the power to destroy, the damage would be terrible. Hey, 
Is there anything we could do to maybe calm them down a little? Maybe not followed his whole whole journey? Let Nagisa destroy the monarch Kuma? Uh, too soon. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. I haven't done the summer camp thing because I wanted to uh, do it with Buddy and she hasn't uh, beaten V3 yet. We're hoping to do that after this at some point. Um, we've got kind of like two other games that we're looking at because we want to try Raincode when it comes out and also uh, Paranormal Site. The way they are now, I doubt it. We don't have to be afraid anymore! We might lose our lives. We might take lives. But either way, we will not be afraid anymore. He will kill or be killed, but we won't be afraid of it. Now I feel completely unafraid of everything. Today, we make the memorial of our victory. We make the memorial of the kids' defeat. <laughs> It's hard to believe these are the same adults that were so scared earlier. They want blood. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I played a little bit of Hat in Time. Um, I played it back in the beta when there was only a couple levels, but one of the levels really freaked me out because her and I aren't really good at stealth or anything like that. And I think there was one in, like, a haunted mansion where, like, you had to, like, hide from this thing. The moment they saw that stupid huge monokuma, I never got past it. Lit up. <laughs> I never played it. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it is their last time. It's kind of cute. Hmm. But maybe For that it's part, far too apparently. big of a hug. Yeah, yeah. That. <laughs> There's no way they'd listen to us if we told them to go easy because they're just kids. Shirakuma, do you have any ideas? There is one. Well then, hurry up and say it. Blow it up. The Monokuma's running amok in town aren't moving on their own like me. Oh, find the. I mean, technically you're not moving around. Them orders. On your own. Somewhere. Oh well, no, because Shirokuma said they gained a. They gained a, a conscious a consciousness. No, I. <laughs> I would guess that the <laughs> controller oh, is at the kids <laughs> HQ. If we get to Toa Hills before the battle gets out of hand and destroy that device. Yep. The Monokumas will stop functioning all at once, and the kids will no longer have an army. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> if you guys do that, but you know, I'm sure you can prevent the fight it between also adults and children. helps him not die somehow. <laughs> That's true, Hero did survive, so... Yeah, it's not like they're a group of fanatics who would attack defenseless children. Mm -hmm. I hope. Point made. But who's going to do it? It sounds really dangerous. Who do you think? Uh, about that... Oh, you better not tell us to do it. Sneaking into heavily guarded enemy territory to look for a device that's who knows where... That's just begging to get killed. But when the Big Bang Monokuma starts attacking, the Monokumas will be busy dealing with that. That's fair. If you use that as a distraction, it won't be impossible to break into Toa Hills. Just improbable. Whether it's possible or not isn't the problem. Why do we have to be the ones to risk our lives? Because we have skins. Because we but don't want to kill all the children. Zyakia, we have to go to Toa Hills anyway. Right? Oh, there we go. Magic word. Yeah? But a device used to control Monokumas is obviously going to be well guarded. Yeah, she doesn't even have hearts. I know, I know, she just got batteries. No matter what the plan is, it's just not possible. Why can't we just take batteries out of every Monokuma we pass? I know I'm asking you for a lot, but you two are the only ones I can rely on anymore. I beg you, Sorry. you guys are the only ones who can save this town. Save this town? What do you mean? That's not what we're in this for. We're not heroes or anything, you know? Why put us in that situation? Wait, Toko. I'll try. Hey! What are you saying? Komaru's really stepping up. 
I know it's dangerous, but even then, I can't just leave it like this. I know I'd regret it later on. Maybe you want to be like your brother? You admire him? It's not like that. Hm. So it's definitely like that. I knew it. You have a brother complex. No, seriously, it's not. Kamaru, you've grown. I'm so glad to see you like this. That's what's been bothering me. Huh? Watching this new you, for some reason, it concerns me. I don't know. You're just worried because she's your friend. Don't worry. I'll be just fine. After all, I have a reliable friend named Toko. Oh. Well, I think it's because... <sighs> she didn't even try and help Kotoko, though. That was actually Toko that did it, I think. Yeah. Um, and I think the first two, she was just kind of, like, really stunned that it all went down, like, really quickly, you know? Because I think I would be a little freaked out and frozen if a, a mass of kids just, like, grabbed a kid and just tore them to pieces. Uh, that, that's... well, it's true, but... So, it's the final hour. What are you guys gonna do? Fine. You want me to go, right? Happy? Jeez, like I even have a choice. However, the objective is rescuing Master. Everything else is secondary. Yeah, okay. Thanks, you two. Thank you so much. You good? Mm. You itchy? Looks like it's about to begin. Should hurry. What a smug asshole. Yeah, Kyoko is the best. Master, if our plan succeeds, catch me in your open arms, Master. I want her to jump at him and him to just let her hit the floor. Oh, he would absolutely. <laughs> he would just sidestep. All right. Um. Okay, so there's this. Shiro X Kenshiro, a super size, a super big size demon who is in charge of a secret assassin skill. It was supposed to be the strongest human alive in the demon world, and its assassin fist can even break the ground in half. Don't hunt it alone, but it's supposed to actually be really sick, so stay far from it and make it all tired before you kill it. Oh, I think that's the person who actually beat uh, Sakura. Because it said it was the strongest person alive. I don't know, I think if she had, I think if you hung out with Sakura, I think she mentioned there being one person she couldn't ever beat. And I think that was them. Um, I'm really struggling to pull that memory though, so I could be wrong. Uh, it makes sense though. Hey, can I give you a card? Mm -hmm. What's up? Something happened. <laughs> oh, yes. Perfect time. Um. <laughs> hey, this is me. <laughs> Look at me. This is me now. Slowpoke Maru. Huh? Hey, what's the big idea handing me something like this? You better not be making fun of me. Oh. No, I wasn't thinking anything. I was just handing it over like I normally do. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not that kind of per woman to get pissed off about something like this. Mm. About what? <laughs> yeah, thought so. Hmm. You really thought so? You look kind of relieved to me. You probably sh thought she was going to hit you with a crowbar or something, right? Stop it! No, honest. I was not thinking about getting hit with a crowbar and dragged behind a bike. No, really. I'm telling the truth, Miss Hagakure. I'm innocent. 
Wow, you really, really suck at lying. More importantly, this file is so rude. I'm sure they could have written it a little nicer. <laughs> what, really? I don't know. I think typical demon is pretty well put. How would you describe it? Um, um, like how the hair is unique, or how she reads a ton of manga? Or how she makes funny noises with an electric fan? Or how she's not really good with numbers? <laughs> And that's about it, right? It's gonna be alright. Coco, there's nothing embarrassing about being normal. Stop it! It's not like I'm embarrassed. More importantly... Um, more importantly, they wrote unknown for hunting grounds. They haven't found you. You should be happy about that, not sad about the whole typical demon part. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as a normal girl, I'm happy in a perfectly normal way. Remember when I told you you sucked at lying? That was a conversation. Hey, hey! Targeting the elderly, too. They <laughs> really don't discriminate. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, if they just waited a week, he probably would die of old age. Then there's no need to kill him. Togo! Togo, that's rude. You have to res respect. Jeez. Respeculate your elders. Why are you so? You can't even say it properly. And? She even said a longer word. <laughs> By the way, what was the detective library again? I feel like I've heard that somewhere before, but I can't remember. You're right. If we can trust what's written here, isn't it some kind of detective unit, Yin? Or maybe a group that mediates jobs to private investigators? <laughs> so it's just like a manga artist union. Okay. If that helps you, sure. Anyway, a union of detectives sounds super cool, kind of like a secret organization. Hmm. Hmm. Real life detectives are no good at all. Hey. Hmm? Why not? Don't detectives in real life solve super cool investigations like in manga? No. Well, I guess it's not that actual detectives are no good. Or like most situations don't even require a detective. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Unless there's some super complicated case, detectives aren't really needed. Of course, most police officers and judges fit that bill, too. You're right. Right, that goes without saying. I guess that's why I'm repulsed by them so much. <laughs> For some reason, that sounds philosophical. Leave it to me. Anyway, regardless if they're detectives or culprits, we gotta save them now. Leave it to me. I'll sh solve it in a flash, just like manga detectives. <laughs> I bet you would. <laughs> She's great. Hey, hey! Assassin Fist, are the captives really allowed to do that kind of BS in this game? <laughs> Isn't this just some kid wrote up? Something some kid wrote up? They're probably just making it up. No. No, my guess is this is the truth. I know a monster just as powerful as this guy. Hmm. A monster? You're right. Yeah, she was called Ogre and the strongest person in the world. And those nicknames were no exaggeration, she really was a monster. And if she can exist, I'm sure that something like Assassin Fist exists. Then is it true that his days are numbered? Sounds like the plot from a manga. Well... It is a familiar story. Assassins always have short lives, just like how female spies always somehow fall in love. <laughs> well, even though I don't really get that reference, you can leave this to me. Assassin Fist or no, I'll take the responsibility of saving him. Just kidding. Of course, I'm not personally going. Woo! Okay. Okay, anything over here? Anything over here? Alright. Off we go. Yeah, I'm missing three parts. Not fun. It's fine. It's fine. Could it be? <clears throat> that weapon. Don't tell me you used it on a child. No. Don't worry. This is for Monokumas. No matter how horribly we were treated, I can at least keep my sense intact. I'm not going to just crush all their little heads like watermelons. Sounds like you want to. Yeah, I thought not. But if something were to happen, that would be a different story. 
some horrible, unthinkable situation occurred. Well, then I just have to use this on a kid. Don't mess with me. Wh what happened to your sense of tact? Hey. You sound so certain deriding me. If you don't kill the kid, the woman next to you is dead. What if that were the situation? Would you just remain a spectator, watch her die? Well, that's. <laughs> I went outside with a resolute mind. If something happens, I will not hesitate to kill. If I hesitate, keep making excuses. I'm the one who will end up dead. Um, Toko, we should go. I mean, he's got a point, but like. They are dying. guys coming with us too? Um, uh, well, not really. No. No, don't worry about it. There's no need for you to risk your lives. You're still a young woman. It's been so long since I felt this. I feel completely free. Why do you think you've already won? You're right. It's true. I don't know what's going to come of all this. But the day we stand up against these kids is finally here. It makes me happy. I'd much rather fight a kid and die than return to a life of hiding and fear. Um, please be careful. <laughs> yeah, even if it's my time to die, I'll be sure to take some kids and monokumas with me. Alright. Okay. I think I'll make it to the next save point and then call it a day. I wonder if everyone's heading to Tella Hills. It looks like a real war. They, like they just put them out in the middle of nowhere. Is that <laughs> mole man piloting that thing? Looks like he's getting out a lot of pent up anger. Are the children going to be okay? Now's not the time to think about the enemy. Sorry. Why are you harassing her? I don't know. New Monokuma? Oh, new area. So that's Toa Hills. Impressive. Oh, I see a sparkle up there. Oh god! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> I was so focused on the other guy! Toko, you could. Thank you. Well, that was exciting. No, scary. I was so busy looking at that sparkle right there, and I was like, well, first let me deal with these Monokuma over here. Hey! Number one acquired. Rip. T vision. These children, they look completely terrified. I wonder why. I, yeah, I wonder why. <laughs> Probably just scared once they saw adults were fighting back. Remember those idiots back when you were a kid? The ones who would mess with a chained up dog? Inevitably, they'd get bitten and then they would end up with a fear of dogs. But, but don't they just look, look just horrified? They're completely frozen in fear. You're right. Maybe they're more childlike than we imagined. They never thought it would come to this, or. <gasps> Or, do you know something? No. No, nothing definitive, just a feeling. 
Regardless, once we get to the kids' HQ, we'll have all the answers, even if we don't want them. I mean, I'm just... I don't think, like... They kind of seem like they had to do this because they have those helmets on. Yeah. Them. I don't necessarily think they all were just like, yeah, let's kill all of the people. Kill all humans. New skill. New skill. Do we even look at the other new skill we got? Oh, yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Destroying urge. Max batteries plus one. I mean, sure. Adventure. It is highly more likely to drop after defeating an enemy. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I already got that one. Yeah. I've got both of those. I could take away the max battery for now and then put that on because we've got all the EXP ones on. Yeah. It'll only take like three more ones. And I don't use the batteries too, too much, so. Much to catch the chagrin. Ding dong, bing bong. Ding dong, bing bong. So the door opens if you ring the bell? That's kind of weird. Is it? Yes. One, one, zero, three, seven. We got in pretty easy, huh? Maybe it's because Big Bang Monokuma is making such a mess. Oh Maybe yeah, I'm they sure they're not expecting you Toto, at all. What are you looking around for? <laughs> There's no mistaking it. Master is here! The red string tied to my pinky. Oh, I can feel it tugging. But in a building this big, it's going to be hard to find him. Well, obviously, all we have to do is catch the head brat and make them spill. And while we're at it, we can make them stop controlling the Monokumas. Two birds, one stone. Knowing those brats, I bet they're somewhere up high where they can watch it all go down. Yeah, that seems likely. That seems dangerous with the giant Monokuma breaking down buildings. Yeah. But from here on, we can't let our guard down. The Monokuma controller has to be well protected. Let's buckle up and get moving. I mean, yeah. honestly, the safest place Let's now would this. be in the sewers. Personally, I'm hoping for an easy yeah. ending. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good. I'm sure we'll get it. And while the credits roll, you'll be all jealous watching Master and me passionately embrace. Okay, if the credits roll and I don't see a picture of Toko and Byakuya hugging, which is probably just Byakuya very disgusted and Toko clinging to him, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Make a note. Heard. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'll be jealous of that. For some reason, oh. I feel Whoa, like I've seen course. this before. There's no chance it would suddenly ambush us, right? Um. <gasps> hmm. I like the drums in this version of this song. I was dreaming out. Okay, we're gonna need to take control of something soon. Tokuichi Toa, representative of Toa Group in Toa City, announced plans today to rebuild Toa Hills, a city landmark only trumped by Toa Tower. This time, reconstruction will upscale the build business side of Toa Hills. Toa Hills has entertained residents and tourists alike, and with the remodeling, the business and private sectors will be completely revitalized. Construction begins in one year and is slated for completion three years later. How many times could they say Toa in that book? Five. I like this version. Mm. 
Sorry, Virginia. Um, okay. So, wait. Hold on, I'm confused. What? So, this is four floors? Mm -hmm. Or. I don't know. Because it looks like the same thing above, but like. It also shows the upstairs stairs right on that map, and I don't understand. This arcade machine is everywhere, isn't it? What the heck? That's a cool room. <laughs> Catch! Hi. Use that guy to step on the switch, which opens the door, and then the bomb? Ugh. God, I'm confused. Excuse me? Is facing away, so I could technically hit that move. And then I think they move. And then I gotta move that car. Okay, okay, I could get there. I don't. I could probably hit the car. Oh. So I'm thinking. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. So I maybe I am able to hit that. Because I haven't looked at the answer yet. Maybe you have to move the bomb guy off, take the other guy up, and then use that bomb guy to like throw a bomb at the not the. Yeah, okay. I think, yeah, I think you're right. I move that guy over. Move that guy up there onto the switch facing that machine. Move the car. Move the machine. Then the guy will move off the switch. No, I can't have him move off the switch because then I need to roll the thing. But I think if he hits, uh, I think if he hits that bomb guy and that bomb guy is right there, it'll still explode the guy on the switch, maybe. Okay. It says, shoot the device in the north with the bullet so that the bomber leaves the switch. Mm -hmm. And short shoot the normal Monokuma with Link and move him to the switch. Make sure he faces the wall. Walk past the switch, go directly to the south from there, shoot the car with the bullet, make sure he stands south of the car, shoot the bomb on Makuna with knockback bullet that... Oh, okay, I see, so go, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. You so. gotta make sure you... Yeah, cause you can't, like, walk by the front entrance. Okay, so I hit the... Hooray. <laughs> no item 
and vault. After we equip the skill and drop more items. <laughs> I think some rooms are just like that though. Why? This Why? looks like the room with that Why? mask kid. Why? Tools everywhere. Oh, it smells like paint thinner. Um, oh, paint thinner. No wonder I was feeling a little these. loopy. Hmm. Oh, it's is this Nagi Shesson? Hey, if we use the remote control, we can oh. move the robot, right? I see. It seems dangerous to just start playing with it. Why don't you touch it? Did you call me a scrub? First, you called us a dumpster fire. <laughs> So I could have just yoloed it, but eh. <laughs> no, you're not. Wait. That didn't like screw something up. I don't think I could go past them anyway. No, probably not. Or actually, I think I can because I have the control for them. So I don't think they're going to. Girl, Ugg. Crystalline? It's oh, or are machine. you doing, um, are you doing a primer? <laughs> It's mostly flooded. Be careful that you don't shock yourself. Oh, I gotta get that guy off the thing. Wow. Okay, it looks like I have to go over there, shoot that, he goes down. And you have to go, go over down. there, shoot that, he goes over. And then, then oh, shoot that, that he goes over. I guess I go up there, but I don't know. I don't know how to get that one. Which one? This one who turns. Shoot that, he goes down. Shoot that, he goes over. I think you just need to move that one, and after that you just shock one. Oh no! Them. Okay, I have to. I have to go. I can't turn that one on yet. I have to go by when he's not looking, and then go over here. Oh, I I just need to get him on there. That's right. Double check. But I have to be able to shoot one from behind, and also I think not be on the water. If I use uh if I use the paralyze while I'm on the water, do I take damage? Catch, do you happen to know? I do. So I have to stand on that safe spot. Wait, I don't even know how I would do that. Oh, I know how okay, okay, I got it, okay. So here, buddy, this is how it happens, I think. Let me, let me walk you through it. All right, shoot that one, he goes down. Then I go this way, shoot that one, he goes over. Mm -hmm. Then I go up here, I sneak by when he's not looking. I shoot that one, he goes down. Then I come over here, sneak by again, go all the way over, sneak by, shoot that, he goes over. I sneak over here, hit this, and then hit him in the back. I think. Who 
the sneaking pie is the one that I need to remember. Because I don't touch that one in that little nook. And I have to move the guy off of that last, I think. Because I need to be able to get by there so I can move that guy. So that I can go by there. There's so many instructions for this one, but... I think... We saved right before this. Yes. Yeah. So. This room. Does that pervert grade schooler live here? You know, the one who stole your. I said nothing happened! No skill. No skill. We can open the door. If you have to like do the same thing for the next floor. Oh uh, yeah, the other two. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Where are these walls? Yeah. These are that one was kind of fun. Yeah. It's just a lot of steps I had to remember, and they had to be done in a specific order, is the only problem. But we, we made it. I just want to go up there and see if there's anything to the sides. son didn't exist, so much I could have done if I never had him. I could have obtained qualifications, licenses, taken lessons, worked more. Instead, my entire life is just a platform for my son's life. I think about it every night before I go to sleep. If I woke up in the morning and my son was dead, how splendid would that be? But every time I wake up and see him, I sigh. Why are you still alive? Why do you have a normal life? I yearn for the day he stops being healthy and stops growing and just disappears. That's all I want. Why can't you just do something that like simple? There was more to that. What? Oh, another side arrow. I didn't think so. What was that? Oh, oh my. Shoot. Uh, I was like, how I feel about him or something. I shouldn't have had him. Oh. 
I want him to die so badly it makes me cry, and the fact that he has such a worthless face just makes me even more sad. It makes me think I'm the one who's wrong. I shouldn't have had you. Wow. That was just hard. Okay, that's what I thought. Oh yeah. Her thing is worth like eight times more than mine, younger women. The thing is, poor bitch doesn't understand that she's worth more than the younger she is. If you're looking for cost effectiveness, you gotta sell it when you're still young. But it's a waste of time telling a ten year old any of that, I guess. That's why mommy has to sell it for you. I'll sell it with you as a set. Even if you cry and say it hurts or it's too scary, the men still pay. Sometimes they even pay more. Even tears have value. Being young is a horrifying thing. It's not like I want money. It's not like I want to entrust my dream to my daughter. It's not like I'm a pervert. I do this all for this, for the love of my child. I do it for her sake so she can sparkle forever. No matter how much she hates me or how much society will beat me up for it, I know my actions are right. It's the parent's job to shine the spotlight on their child. Go fuck yourself, dude. I am glad you're dead. Although that sounded like her mom, and also her dad writing that. Oof. Both of them. That's that's what's really screwed up. Okay. I think we'll call it here, and then hopefully we'll be able to do the rest of the tower. Uh, oh my god, I don't know how to play this game. Hopefully next week we can do the rest of this uh, tower. We're getting towards the end. I like these puzzles a bit better than the last chapter. The last chapter was just uh, terrible puzzle-wise. I, I absolutely hated the intricacies of it. Yeah. More so, it just seemed like, depending on the AI, it would just screw up. Um, so, that wasn't very fun. But, at least once I've been okay so far. Mm -hmm. And the laser thing wasn't too, too bad, actually. Yeah, um, no. Even it, when you did trigger it, it wasn't, like, the worst thing to, like, hand deal with. Yeah, I, I think I just didn't like the angle if you were, like, too close to it. And also, uh, sometimes it felt like the bullets didn't reach. But I think that might just be because I was using burn. Because I didn't have any break. And I don't think burn flies as far as mm. break. Which is the problem. Um... So I guess my issue is I wish they had given me more break bullets before all of that shit. Ah. Uh, but we're, we're almost, we're almost there, I think. I don't know. Catch, how big is this tower? Is it really long? Do you think this one is a shorter chapter than last chapter? That's fair. Well, I know we all we already have another. I assume that room we're about to go in is probably it's either just like a kind of like staircase of like the same thing. So it would be nice to beat this game next time. Yeah, but I don't know if. Yeah, I just get too stressed out playing. And my tooth hurts. Oh, well, not my tooth hurts. My gums hurt, I should say. My, to my teeth feel fine for once. <laughs> I also should. I kind of wanted to go out and try and build that table. Mm. I'm just sleepy because I have alcohol. <laughs> That's true. You did. Didn't, they didn't let me rest. <laughs> they didn't let you take a nap. They took you out so that you could buy them a pool. Which I didn't even buy. A dad wrote a check for it. <laughs> a check? Yeah. Are you saying he used currency? <laughs> The only reason
reason I argue that one so much is because I know that Persona 5 has been wrong on a, a question before. And so... I don't know if it's in Royal. I just know in the original one they said something about, like, one of the questions was like... Uh, when did people start dreaming in color? And people were like, when colored TV came out? And I'm like... I'm pretty sure if there was, like, some weird, strange phenomena where, like, before colored TV, people were only s dreaming in black and white, that would be pretty crazy, and Mom would have told us because she used to have black and white TV before she had colored TV. It's like, you see everything in color. Yeah, you see Just everything in color. Besides the television. Yeah, the, the way they probably should have worded it was the... Uh, there was more of an occurrence prior to colored TV of people dreaming in black and white because of seeing all the yeah. like, black and white. T but there's no way that everybody just dreamed in black, black and white. <laughs> no, let me go ask mom right now. Did you dream in black and white? <laughs> Tell me! Right now! How dare you! I should probably be like, what the hell are you talking about? But yeah, I, I like I saw that question. And I was like, "What? <laughs> Are you serious? That's the answer?" <laughs> All right, whatever, <laughs> whatever, guy. I think you're trolling me. And then, and then the game was like, "Yeah, that's the right answer." And I'm like, "You're full of shit." <laughs> uh, but hopefully, we'll actually be back on Thursday with Persona. Finally, it's been a hot minute. It has been one the longer game. True. So don't pass out this time. Oh my god. I, I I really apologize. Like I was I was like, okay, there's like forty minutes until we stream. I'll watch this like twenty minute video and then I'll go make a coffee and You'll stuff. Be fine. And uh, I just completely fell asleep. And when I woke up, I was just like barely able to see anything, and I just like laid on the floor. No, I was like, no, it was like I think, I think it was only an hour, so it was like five o'clock. I was like, yeah, we could probably have a late stream. And then she went down the ground. It's like, nope, oh, nope, we're done. <laughs> no, no, she's done. Day's done. I was like, look at Indy, he's so cute. Out, Out. like a light. <laughs> And like he laid under the other chair, I'm like, well, I guess everybody's just sleeping. I feel, uh, well, I feel like because it got really hot, it got really hot, and then it was cold in here, so mm. then I was bundled up in blankets, and then um, also, what was the reason? There was some other reason. I think I was mentally exhausted because I knew that we were gonna have like a couple big trucks before inventory. Before inventory. And I feel like there was something. Oh, I hadn't had my coffee yet, but I was so cold I didn't want to get up and go make it. No, I'm not tired of you. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that, that happened. Oh, my back hurt. That's what it was. My back was really hurting, so I stretched out on the floor. That was why I laid down. Well. Because my lower back was really bothering me last week. Yesterday when I had to work for real, and I had the shitty pancake gun, usually you do like two pushes and you get a good section. I had to do like four or five times. And I have to stretch to like back of the grill to like get a pancake back there. So I thought I was like stretching and trying to get like a good size. Bro, it was blowing oh. my back out. I'm sorry, buddy. Yeah, when we have like a lot of shoes, ooh, I don't get the double mats to stand on, and I can really feel it when I don't have two mats to stand on. Mm. Like it starts like my lower back starts pulling. It's crazy. But, uh, yeah, I guess we'll sign off for the night. Uh, sorry it was a short stream. We finished chapter four, though. Yeah! And we, uh, we finished, uh, the first two, uh, puzzles. puzzles. Which there's at least two more. Yeah, uh, for my so it looks like there's only, like, five of those in this chapter. Okay. So, we have so it's probably two, two more to get those other two robots. Probably. And then mm. probably one final robot. Yeah. 
here. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll be back uh, Thursday, and um, hopefully we'll get this done so we can start a uh, paranormal site, and then because that one's spooky and we might end up wanting to take a break from that one anyway. Uh, we'll probably play a bit of that. I know that I'm gonna get tired because it's a visual novel. So it's gonna be all reading. Mm. <laughs> I mean, obviously I can probably do some reading too. Yes. Um, I but, can do all like the like details. But I think Buddy and I definitely want to try out Rain Code, so... And then in the middle of those, we might have some Katamari <laughs> streaks. Oh, yeah. Wait, when's Katamari coming? Uh, the beginning of June. Oh, okay. So we might not start Paranormal Site right away because I think we've only got one more week of May. I'll double check. Or at least, probably at least one more Monday. Yeah, one more Monday. So next Monday and then one that, no. Or just next Monday. Next Monday. Alright, so we have to beat this game next Monday. You don't have to get up early on Tuesdays anymore, right? Nope. Super long stream next time, probably. I probably should have just continued more now, but... <laughs> yeah. I think it's good to just kind of do, do the tower. Yeah. Alright, so... We'll be back Thursday at Persona and Monday. Super Long String Monday. We're super long. I, I'm uh, already gonna have to mentally prepare myself. No cop outs because we if she falls play. asleep, I'll smack her away. <laughs> we wanna. We definitely wanna uh, play Katamari on yeah. stream. Yeah. I don't know if it has like multiplayer, like good multiplayer, but we'll just uh, we'll see switch how. off yeah. on each level. Um, but anyway, see you Thursday. Bye. Bye.